Hey guys, alright, welcome to this video. So in this video I'm going to show you today how to use ClickFunnels to sell insurance. Now, uh, just so you know, um, this is this is my whole funnel. I'll show you the whole funnel I have really quick. If you see it's really long, and if you don't know what funnel is, don't worry about it. Uh, I actually didn't know what it meant a year ago, but it's actually a really long funnel. And the reason I did that is I have the home page, or I have a page, then I have a thank you page. Now I haven't even finished uh, decking everything out but you can customize it however you want so for instance for myself the reason I have a thank you page after each step in the funnel is eventually I'm gonna have like for instance on this page here on the thank you page here it's gonna say hey thank you for uh, requesting information um, if you look here's some some other products that we have and and I'll, I'll show you what I mean by that and then same here for dental it's like hey thanks for requesting information on dental uh, you may want to check out these products or whatever I want to talk about with dental so I'll, I'll be able to completely customize everything I want so that's why I have a really long uh, funnel so if you know anything about funnels most people have like one or two or three steps I have like 20 I think it's 18 or something like that exactly I forget where it shows you, but I haven't encountered it in a while. And I constantly add and subtract and change stuff around, and you can too. So that's what's really cool about ClickFunnels, is you can change it as much as you need to. So we'll start here with my home page. Uh, let me show you the, f the the front end. This is what the customer sees. So when the customer logs in, when he goes to SpartanInsuranceNetwork.com, uh, this is the home page. They'll see, this is just a quick video about the home page. Uh, they say that it helps with conversions, so that's why I put that there. Uh, here in this big red button is a request a quote, so depending on what they're looking for. But here I just have a couple bridges to my some of my other pages, information pages I have. Uh, they can click on one of these, whatever they're looking for, and I'll kind of go through with, uh, with you each one, what they cover, what they don't cover. Then I have just basic information about myself and my insurance agency, and then I have some of the, the, the companies I work for and carry uh, insurance for. Another really cool thing I have here is their, um, I have a uh, Facebook widget, so um, <clears throat> if they want to send me a message directly with Facebook, they can. Uh, nobody's done yet, but they have the option to. But uh, and I also haven't really started generating any traffic, especially to this page. I've been using uh, organic traffic and, and LinkedIn just to kind of generate traffic. But now I'm actually uh, starting to do. Um, uh, YouTube ads and uh, Google ads uh, to uh, individual pages. I would never do it to my home page because there's just too much going on here. I mean, there's just a lot going on. But a lot of times, customers do want to see your home page. They don't. They do want to see what else you have to offer, and they will click on home page. So each page has a has a way to get to the home page, and I'll show you what I'm talking about here. So. Anyways, we'll start here. Uh, this is the home page, like I was telling you. This is the back end. This is how I edit stuff. This is how I add and subtract stuff. And like I said, if I wanted to add more products, I could. Let's say I wanted to add four more products. And I'm actually about to add um, a, a new row, but I'm going to call it, uh, you know, featured websites. Or I haven't even decided what to add or what to call it. So that's why I haven't added. But you can customize it however you want. Let me show you what I'm talking about here. So let's say I want to add a whole new row of stuff. Uh, this little button here is a clone so it actually just cloned everything that's on this and it, it literally cloned the whole thing so obviously I don't want that but if I wanted to add one or two things I could do it a little bit different but I just want to show you how easy it is to add and subtract stuff so I'll go ahead and delete that back. Um, here you can change whatever you want if you want to change the wording here, uh, if you want to change the wording there, if you want to change the, the logo um, there's a way to do it. I'm not going to go through that right now. It's not what this video is about. It's just a basic overview. But you can put on here whatever you want, um, your mantra, your beliefs, whatever. If you want to put your, your products you sell, the companies you sell for, that's what the homepage is for. And like I said, I never drive traffic here. Uh, this is really just so if a customer wants to learn a little bit more about you, they can. Uh, let me show you some other cool things about here. Uh, you can also monitor your SEO data, for instance. Um, this is what, when somebody clicks on your web page, uh, here's what it's going to say at the top of their screen. Uh, this little thing's up here, if you see, each one of these has a sentence. Uh, but that's how you you monitor what your customer sees about you, what they're going to see on S uh, if they look for you on Google, uh, what shows up there. So uh, obviously you can monitor all this stuff also. So anyways, we'll exit out of this guy. And oh, yeah, we'll 
and I leave. Yeah, I don't think I needed to save anything there. So, uh, and that's what's kind of cool. It, it, the reason it did that is if I changed something, it, it, it wanted me to save it. This is the second page I was telling you about. This is just a thank you page. Uh, eventually, I'm going to have like a product specific thank you page. Like for dental, I'll have one. For car insurance, for everything, I'll have one. So, everything is customizable. Like I said, just um, you just got to change it yourself, whatever you want to do. So, uh, thank you. So, like, for instance, here I said thank you for requesting information. We will contact you shortly. So, um, and what that means is they submitted their information, saying they would like some more information uh, about the products I offer. So, anyways, we'll go to the second page in the funnel, and I kind of line these all up for you. I forget what page this is. Okay, so this is my dental page. So with this page here is what's called a bridge page. So, uh, for instance, here. Uh, I, I do primary and secondary or, or supplemental dental, but a lot of people don't know what supplemental means, so I just put secondary. Uh, and you can custom, custom word it however you want to. So I have a basic information video um, about what dental insurance is, what it covers, and if they scroll down, they'd like to know some more. There's just more information about each one of them. And like I said, here's another link. This talks a little bit more about primary dental. This is more about supplemental dental. So, um, and like I said, they have the option to uh, bridge over directly to the carrier page, or if they want to talk to somebody about it, uh, they can do that right here. So, and like I said, if they want to message through Facebook, they can. So, here's what the back end looks like. This is what at my end I can edit stuff. Like I said, I ha if you can see, it goes directly to the carrier. Uh, if they want to, but guys, I'll be honest with you right now, um, the, the probability of them signing up directly through your website, uh, I think it's like at 1%, so you're going to have to generate a lot of traffic to get somebody to sign up directly through your website without talking to somebody. I thought about just removing these uh, to see how many more um, clicks I'd get as far as people getting to speak to me, and they have to speak to me in order to sign up, but... Um, for right now, since I'm not delivering any paid traffic through there, uh, it's not really costing me anything. So I'm just leaving it like that for right now. But you can do whatever you want with it. You can take these take these buttons off and um, have it to where they have to call you. They have to speak to you. But uh, as for me, that doesn't really make sense right now. I'd rather just have it the easy way where they can sign up if they want to. But you can do whatever you want. So close that window out. And like I said, we already saw this guy here. This is the dental page. What's next here? All right, here we have uh, my annuity page. So this is what's called an application page. If you see here, it talks a little bit about do you qualify for new annuity options. If you sell annuities, uh, you can have this on there. If you don't, you can take it off. Now here, this is actually a WooFu form. Um, and it's wufu.com. It's very simple. It's just asking basic information to see if they qualify for or if they were even a fit for annuities. Uh, there's just 10 questions on here. And the reason there's 10 is because that's what comes with their free package. I haven't even upgraded to their main package only and it's like $10 a month only because I, I don't really sell a lot of annuities and like I said I don't have any traffic any paid traffic coming here if anybody clicks on it it's because they came from one of my other sources so I I, um, I specialize primarily in life insurance so that's really what I want to get people on but if they're looking for other products then they're able to um, to click around and look around and, and like I said what I do is I try to get people on life insurance and if they want the other products I'll gladly sell it to them. So you may have a different strategy, you may have different products, so you can customize it to however you want. So I just have some basic information about annuities, that way they can um, feel assured that it's not just um, uh, just some fly-by-night company. Hopefully they know you, they know your agency, whatever it may be. So um, just customize it to however you want. So anyways, here, and this is the back end uh, of the annuity page uh, and like you said here's the HTML script uh, what that basically means is Wufu gave me a code that I plugged into here and it, it coordinates directly with my web page so I actually did have somebody um, uh, request information on annuities and I I didn't have my form set up properly so it never asked them um, all their personal information so they submitted a form without any personal information. So I basically got a form with 
people's information but I didn't have a way to contact them so make sure you do basic stuff like that that was definitely a rookie mistake on my behalf so all right next we're going to the supplemental funnel uh, same thing it's more like a bridge funnel but more importantly I'd like to talk to them so I have that here but if they don't want to talk to me and they want to sign up directly they can do that so it's really up to you however you want to your funnel to work uh, how much integration you want my goal is though is eventually I want people to be able to buy products online just like they're buying shoes online like they're buying tomatoes online that's what I'd like to do that's where the market is going uh, it's not there yet we're still at like 1% of people buying uh, their insurance completely online but maybe next year it'll be two percent maybe the year after that it'll be ten percent so uh, you definitely want to get ahead of the curve uh, instead of behind the curve and that's why I have click funnels so uh, this is the this is my life insurance funnel uh, this is what is called a um, video sales letter and sorry I'm clicking around guys I'm looking for the 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 front end of this but no worries you can see the back end so the reason it's called a video sales letter is there's a, a video is just about um, life insurance what it covers uh, there's just ton I just put a couple videos that discuss it and on each one right below it I just you know I put request information or you know here I request information a video more information about um, this here is about living benefits uh, this here is about the million dollar baby so there's just tons of videos um, just in, you know, informing the customer tax free retirement just informing the customer on all the benefits of live insurance so you can do it about whatever you want so as you can see this funnel has tons of different types of funnels and I just made it this way just to kind of educate the customer so uh, next one here is disability here's a quick video about disability and then like I said speak to an agent when they click on that it's gonna request their name phone number basic stuff like that this one here is one of my shortest uh, funnels I don't I don't have a lot of stuff down here only because I just haven't gotten around to it now this is a true opt-in funnel uh, and what it is it's just um, or this is the simplest I guess form of an opt-in funnel it's a video a little bit of information headline subheadline uh, text or you know whatever um, in this page in, in this uh, one here it's just a, a few short sentences about it but you know that's what most people do this is what you're typically going to see um, in a opt-in funnel so anyways uh, this one estate planning this one is a simple bridge funnel and even here let me I wanted to show you the reason I left this on here is I wanted to show you how easy it is to remove stuff so let's say oh yeah this thing this promotions over so I'm just gonna delete it uh, I want to delete the whole box oh so this is actually brings up a good point so if you see here the orange is the the actual element and the blue is the whole row I don't even need the blue row anymore let me just show you what happens so if I delete just the element it's going to do this it's gonna leave that little box there and that's gonna leave a gap in there um, some people may like a gap but in this case I don't want it there so I'm gonna delete the whole row so that way that whole er so there's not a gap in my web page so once I um, delete it now it's no longer there obviously so I'm gonna want to save it so it's saving it and now it saves my updates will appear so that's how simple it is to edit subtract and add stuff even here I haven't changed this to 2019 and you can put whatever you want I mean uh, I put copyright 2019 even though there's not really a copyright on this page but still uh, people like to see that um, you know they feel a little more assured about the page so that's estate planning uh, then here we have affordable health care um, so same thing has basic information about uh, short-term health insurance if you scroll down there's more supplemental products that I recommend going with it and like I said there's just a storyline feature that just has um, you know breaks down what the products are the services are things like that so very very simple um, you know it allows customers to learn more about you and whenever they're ready they can contact you so and here we go and this one here is our auto and home insurance so same thing it's what it's called an application funnel it's asking basic information so you'll be able to ask the information you need from your customer 
before you speak to them. So here it's asking for their zip code, their make and model. You can put one on there, whatever you want. I had on there before like student and uh, are they a student? I, I just took it off. Uh, a, it, it's not 100% important at the moment, but um, but also to it, it freed up more questions for me. So I just need the basic stuff. So date of birth, name, and some people may not feel comfortable giving their date of birth, you know, so you may want to take that off. But um, obviously I left that there. I think that's more important than um, are you a student or things like that. So um, so that's our auto and home insurance. And like I said, if you don't sell auto and home, I actually don't sell auto and home. Uh, last year I worked with a referral company. This year I'm not working with them. So I just kept it on there just in case somebody was looking for it. I can always refer them out to somebody. So, And the last page is, this is my um, uh, recruiting funnel, actually. So um, I call it Join the Rebellion. So that's the, you know, if you want to join my agency. Uh, there's some information about myself, about the industry, um, and all the way here at the bottom, if they want to schedule the time just to speak with me, they can do that right here, or they can join my Facebook group. So if you like this funnel, uh, I'll leave a link. You can have it absolutely for free. It's gonna If you don't have ClickFunnels, it's going to come with a free two-week trial. If you do have ClickFunnels, then it's just going to be added to your uh, share funnels. So it'll be a free download, no cost at all, don't opt in anything like that and I'll also leave a link if you're interested in joining my agency my team um, you know I'll leave a link for that too so thanks for your time appreciate it